yourself yet? <laughs> Come on, Rich. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I started uh, powerlifting in 2003. Um, I was boxing for a long time before that and used to struggle to make weight. Um, used to fight around 63 kilos and as I was getting older I was um, I was struggling to keep the weight down. Um, I picked up a little back injury and started to rehab it. Um, so I switched over to weightlifting um, briefly, a few of the um, track and field events and found that the power lifts seemed to be naturally suited. I, uh, I competed in 2003 quite early on in the Great London Championships, uh, which I won and qualified me for the um, my first British Championships. I won that and that took me to the world, so from the um, February to the November, um, I done my first meet and then ended up becoming the British Champion and the World Champion um, in space for about nine months. Um, after that, I don't think I, I lost a competition until about 2011, where I come third in my um, in my class at another World Championships. Um, since then, I've had a couple of years off to concentrate on opening up the gym, and just recently got back into training. Um, I'm the current British champion, and in May I'm getting ready for the next uh, World Championships. Being World Champion was good, but it wasn't quite as um, as satisfying as as I expected because it was um, it was quite soon and I think um, refining my uh, my lifting since then has been uh, more satisfying getting uh, compliments from uh, famous coaches and um, well-known lifters was probably a big achievement than, um, than what I've won. Originally I was um, quite into art and I was quite into sport and, um, and when I left school I figured I'd try uh, one or both of them so I quickly realised the uh, the art world um, wasn't the place for me, so I switched over to, um, to personal training um, after about a year, year and a half of working in gyms. Um, eventually I was, um, I was approached by various members to, for me to train them, so at that point I, um, I switched over and started personal training. The sport therapy I'd always done pretty much as soon as I qualified and, um, and still do that now. I opened the gym um, after I'd um, worked for a couple of gyms. Um, I'd become a uh, manager at one gym and then switched over to become freelance um, when I was doing the personal training and the, the sport therapy. Um, after going from two or three different gyms and uh, tried working from home I realised that the next best option would be to, to open up a place of my own. Um, we sponsor athletes, we sponsor um, any member that we think is a um, can be a good role model for the rest of the members, um, people who we think are um, dedicated and and just a way of um, showing our appreciation to their talents and and also how they encourage other members. Um, we sponsor a bikini athlete, um, Jeannie. She's um, she's really nice. She's really encouraging to a lot of the members. And it's not just the sporting achievements; it's the fact that she's uh, so hands-on and uh, and willing to help everyone. Is the reason we sponsor her. Um, Abby Graham has uh, been a long-standing client of mine. We've got a few successful powerlifters, but um, she seems to be the one who's, um, again, just most keen to help uh, new people getting into the sport. And, uh, and finally, Oliver Reed. Um, he's a physique competitor, and, um, and we think that he's uh, just quite inspirational, so, so he's got sponsorship too. RP Fitness is for people who don't really want a fitness trend or a, um, a faddy way of getting in shape quickly. We're much more of a lifestyle um, type premises. So if you want to improve your fitness, if you want to do it sensibly and methodically and in a repeatable fashion, then it will be the place for you. But for fads that come and go, really we find the people who join them kind of gyms, they also come and go. So we're in it for people who want to start and we want to be with them on their fitness journey from start to finish really. We first opened up the um, the original RP Fitness in uh, 2012 and 
um, expanded, we've moved to a bigger premises, which is where we are now, down Nuffield Road, and we've been here since, um, for about a year now. Come on, <laughs> 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 <laughs>